All right, let's watch this in full here. There is sound, awesome sound. All right. The only thing I would say is that sound wise, you have some really big this moment here. And this explosion here where it feels like we're going way too crazy with i don't know it's like some clipping of the bass or something where it feels very distorted and just too much like the levels are too much so just watch out for that that you don't break things there um i think animation wise i mean we're so close I, one thing i would start since we are in such a uh you know final area where i feel like we can push the uh, the offset in the timing every now and then of those wings, sometimes they feel like they just go down, it's fairly mirrored. So, you know, one would be lower than the other, just kind of offsetting these by a frame or two every now and then where like the up will be different in terms of one wing, but then it go down and again, it will be slightly different. So they're not so mirrored. So a bit of a general path, uh, pass there. I think when I was watching this, the main thing, the couple bigger things that struck me that I would still fix this is still feeling very sharp on that drop here that comes out of nowhere it doesn't feel physics driven where it just kind of has hang time and it starts to drop that one's a bit weird i don't mind this one just because it adds to that energy of going up that's all cool this starts to feel a bit light that tail swinging around and doing that move and then over there i was keep watch out to not have too many really fast changes i know it's also a bit hidden with this in the shake but that just felt just a bit fast there this one still has a lot of up and down there that up here just feels a bit fast and i mean they really just three four frames adding there and then this one where this one now feels a bit too sharp in the drop it's not going as low I still feel like this is a bummer that we don't see it better here. But I don't think you want to do this because I've mentioned it a couple times and I still see it. The only thing I would say then, have at least the fire go up this way. So it's more prominent right now because it's so low and it's shooting so low. There's really no threat there. It's just, it's just kind of noise. And that would make a bit more of a bigger deal out of this. Just a tad. The biggest thing is here. Where it just feels... I personally would try a pass here once we're starting from here on, no camera shake, and see what that gives us. Because it's hard to see where, some things are just, like this is a big move over one frame, the chopper goes up over one frame, but then I'm looking at also the camera move has some choppiness in there. And then you have this feel like it goes to the right here. And then it kind of stops like visually in 2D frame. Then it goes back to right. Then it has a really big drop down here. And then it's not doing much. You still have those double frames, by the way. And by that, I mean, I can go here and you can see that when I do this. So watch out what's going on in your render. Same thing here again. But it just feels just a bit choppy. I don't know if it's because of the double frames. But I think I would look at clarity first of really going up and hitting this with just a bit of a smoother motion right now it's just a bit choppy and this still feels i mean we're going slightly down but it's still slightly to the right but now we're starting like we're ending here and then you're going over there i would have at least that framed here so we're not jumping too far and i think wait with your pan so that we still feel that right to left and then it gets a bit wonky we're going a bit high again i would just look at very clear framing and then kind of layer maybe some noise or shake in the in the camera but i would keep that just as clean as you can i feel like we're too low the camera person anticipates this a bit too early and then you got moves like this where visually you can see how the head goes to the right to the right and then it's kind of stuck in 2d space stuck again whoa it only goes down to the right it's just that section through there that has a bit of a hiccup wah, wah. and then same thing there with the wings giving a bit of an offset watch out this feels like there's an intersection there 
and then you got some tracking issues at the end here of your explosion moving over here but definitely better on the feeling of the fall and continuing yeah so picky things here and there but it's so good it's definitely coming along really really nicely just little little things here and there all right thanks all right there's an email you can sign up you can start whenever you want you can submit whatever you want you get 16 submissions either way a like and subscribe would be awesome all right thank you